Hey guys, Shock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to transfer your SIM card from one Samsung smartphone to another Samsung smartphone. And I'm talking about eSIM, which is electronic SIM. So you're not gonna need a physical SIM card that you usually put into your phone in the SIM card slot. So here's what's going on. I have a SIM card in this phone. I'm gonna transfer it to this phone right now. Now, whether I have a physical SIM or an electronic SIM in this phone, doesn't matter. The procedure is the same. So let me show you how to do that. So first and foremost, if you go to the settings, all right, and if you go over to connections, you are able to go into the SIM manager. Once you go to the SIM manager, it is gonna show you whether or not you have an actual SIM card that would show up right here, or if you have an active eSIM. Now, in my case, I have an electronic SIM card. I have an eSIM that's gonna be transferred over. If you have a physical SIM card, it doesn't matter. What's gonna happen with this procedure is, it's gonna convert the physical SIM card into an eSIM and then transfer it over to this phone, okay? It's a fantastic little utility. Now I'm able to just transfer SIMs back and forth between my Samsung phones within minutes. So once you verify what you have, what you can do is you can exit this and on the phone that is gonna receive the SIM card, what you wanna do is you wanna to go to your settings and then again, go to connections and then go to SIM manager, okay? Once you are at the SIM manager, all you're gonna do is you're gonna tap on add eSIM, all right? So when you tap on plus right over here, it's gonna give you a couple options, all right? And those options are going to be, look at this, transfer SIM from another phone, scan a QR code, which is not gonna apply here, or search for an eSIM, which is not gonna apply here either. So this is the one that we are gonna use. So for this process to work, all you need to do is have the phones sitting next to each other. So look at this, I'm gonna tap on transfer SIM from another phone. It's just gonna know that there's a phone right here, I'm gonna get this pop-up, okay? Once I get this pop-up, all I do is tap on transfer and look at what's gonna happen. The transferation process has started, you're gonna see a code and then you enter that same code right over here 170 and you simply let it do its thing and look at this it's going to show you what sim is going to transfer over again doesn't matter if it's a physical sim or an e-sim on this phone it's still going to transfer okay and then once you select the one that you want you tap on transfer okay and then it says continue on your old phone tap on transfer again just verify the numbers and that's it guys, the process has started. It is checking my information with AT&T in this case. AT&T supports this. It's activating the phone and we are gonna be good to go. We should be almost done here. It's gonna say adding the eSIM. Over here it says SIM transferred. I can tap on done. So this phone is now inactive. Now this is gonna take a couple minutes for it to get processed on this uh, on this new phone, all right? So a great way to just transfer SIM cards back and forth between several phones if you want, okay? Uh, it doesn't work on every single Samsung phone. Mostly it works on the later models, okay? So once the SIM is added, it's gonna show up under your SIM manager right over here. What you are gonna need to do after the transfer is complete is you're gonna probably need to restart your phone, all right? So let's see if I can make a call. Okay, so it's actually just working right away. So I don't even have to restart it. My SIM has been transferred. That's how easy it is. And I can do the same thing. I can send it back from here to here. Fantastic, guys. Any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now. Have a fantastic day.